That's all you need. All right, we got ourselves one cable built uh, to replace this cable here. So let's go ahead and uh, we'll get this installed. Okay, if you remember, uh, we took it off of here and we took it off of here. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab this and we're going to go ahead and put it back on here. Put it back on there all the way and we're going to grab the one that came off of it. And we're going to grab the one that came off of it and we're going to stick it on there. There you go. Now we're going to take the other side and we're going to put it on here where we took it off. It's long, really stiff. Then we're going to take the uh, the other end of the light bulb, uh, the the overtemp light, and we're going to put it on. So this one is done. Now we're going to go ahead and do the other one. The other one comes up here, goes down here, and then goes to the relay. Now this is where you need uh, a good pair of pliers here, and you want to grab this. I would go ahead and pull this heat back or this heat shrink already did it and then put your thumb on here and then grab a hold of it and give it a yank and it should come off so let's get this one out of here there we go there it is and then we'll come down here and we'll pull our pigtail on this off there we go a little piggyback pigtail piggyback whatever I think they call them piggybacks. So let me get this off of here. All right, I got it off. So now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna bring it over here. I'm gonna move the old one out of the way. And then we're gonna build one of these. However, I didn't pull enough off. It's not long enough. <clears throat> so I'm gonna tell you how I'm gonna solve that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go from here and I'm gonna come down this way and come up the bottom right there. And that's long. That's more than long enough for that. So let me get this uh, this little uh, pigtail here built, and then I'll show that to you. All right, we're back. Uh, we've got the piggyback on this side. And if you come over here, you notice there's no piggyback, and that's because this side doesn't have a piggyback because it just plugs into the relay. So let's go ahead and get this one installed. All right, we're over here by the relay. So let's get this pushed in. All right. And we're going to run it down here. Put it up under here. And get this one installed. Oh, and it goes on pretty hard. That's what I want. And then we'll get our uh, other one here. I want to go on. There we go. Pink. So now we have uh, we have part of our main stuff. Now all we have to do is is do the piggybacks that go up in here uh, for the outputs. Now you notice this one actually has like two wires on it. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to take this wire off of here and we'll connect it to here. We'll use we'll put another crimp on there, another blue one, and then this one will just be a regular straight uh, pig jumper going over to through the uh, minimum max switch so let's get this one off and then I'll show that to you all right I used the pliers and I, and I pulled it off there so now let's get this other side off of here this goes to the center side of the minimum minimum and maximum switch yeah this one right here yeah it's on there tight I'm gonna need two hands guys all right I went ahead and got it off uh, now what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna take this wire and this wire and we're gonna put them in a separate crimp notice that electrically they're exactly the same position so that can be done that way so let me go ahead and take this apart get this heat shrink off of here and then I'm gonna cut this wire right here and then crimp these two together and then I'm going to build this pigtail right here. Now notice that the output 
is coming from the red side here because the, the black side's already done. So now I'm going to switch from the black wire and I'm going to start using this red wire down here for my pigtail jumpers for my switches. Well, I'm back and I've, I've got this, uh, uh, these two wires crimped together on a crimp here. And I used the original shield here because I thought it, it, it looked better and, uh, and this wasn't really insulated. I could put a heat shrink over it, but I just wanted to use this anyways. So uh, I actually had to go into the garage and grab a 1416 uh, crimp like one of these. And all I did was uh, I went ahead and cut the blue off so I could use the original jacket uh, on this one right here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build this jumper cable that goes from down here to over to here and this will have this piggyback on it right here. And then we're going to build this piggyback cable that goes over to this side which is red. So that's why I have these here. We have two piggyback sides and we have two regular conductors. So let me get those built for you. Alright I got these uh, pigtails built uh, with the, uh, the piggybacks on them and then the straight plug-ins so let's go ahead and get those installed all right here we go we're gonna go ahead and put this in here one of these suckers are going on there tight there we go and then we're gonna get this side and put it in over here right there and then we're gonna get the little pigtail that goes on and we're gonna stick the little pigtail on Get the cover on it. There we go. Now we're gonna get this one off right here. We're gonna get take this one off and replace it with the red one that's on the table. All right, we got them installed here. Uh, you watched me install this uh, this other pigtail here, and then I went ahead and installed the other one over there. So, and notice that the the uh, the power switches, the left sides aren't used. It's just the uh, the right side of the bank. And on the main power switch, uh, all sides are used. So, anyways, all we have left to do now is just to uh, go ahead and put all the zip ties back in and give it a test. Alright, I've got all the zip ties back on right here and I put one down here and I decided to put one here didn't really need any down here because they were uh, they were in there so uh, you know and they're not going anywhere so I didn't worry about them uh, got our pigtails in here so anyways I just uh, wanted to show you guys how I upgraded uh, the uh, the electrical wires in here if this helped you at all and uh, you learned something please give me a thumbs up Feel free to ask any questions, share your knowledge, guys. Um, and just thanks for watching, and subscribe if you like where the, the way the videos are going. I'll talk with you guys later. This is Keith Nunya. Bye.